What genre of music do you consider yourself? Rap. Hip hop. Are you referred to as a rapper? Yeah. What is your opinion of that phrase? Um, I love it. <laughs> I don't know, like, what you mean, like? Just curious. I don't know if people ever feel disrespected being called a rapper or labeled a rapper yeah. or... I love it. In your opinion, what makes a great rapper? What are those characteristics? I feel like a great rapper is somebody that can, um, uh, what's the word? That can... Take your time. Okay. Uh, damn. That can... I cannot think of the fucking word. Like, that can... I can't even think. Let me ref let me say it one more time. I understand it. I just can't. I can't think of a word to say that. I don't want to say a good performance, but that can. Uh, you can you can say how you want to say it. I'm gonna be over thinking. All right, I'll just restate the question. Okay. What makes a great rapper? What are some of those characteristics? You have to be able to me. You gotta be creative. I guess you gotta kind of uh, be an entertainer, like. You gotta be a good entertainer, I guess. I'm. Re I really can't. I'm having a brain fart. Like, <laughs> okay. I can't really think of the word that I'm trying to say because I understand what you're saying. I just can't think of the word that I'm trying to use for it. But. That's okay. I'm gonna ask you some other questions if okay. you do end up thinking about that. Okay. And it comes back to you. Just stop me and. I'm gonna and... have to because it's gonna it's gonna fuck with me the whole time I'm doing it. <laughs> now moving forward. Okay. How long have you been in the music industry for at this point? Uh, I want to say, like, maybe, like, a year or two. Yeah. And for time reference, it's September 2021 now. Now, mm -hmm. from your opinion, what you've seen, what you've experienced, what's the biggest mistake female rappers make? Uh, I feel like we let a lot of people play on our top. And what I mean by that is, like, uh, say, for instance, um, we, we get compared a lot and we get in our feelings a lot. Well, I used to. Uh, I feel like don't let nobody make you feel less of yourself. Dudes in the industry, not all of them, but a lot of them, they quick to make you feel less of yourself or feel like you're not hard or, um, you know, make or make you feel like you got to do things that uh, you don't have to do. Not saying I do stuff like that, but I've heard stories where girls feel like, you know, they got to get out their body to do certain stuff and you don't. So if you're a female rapper out there, like, you ain't got to be, you know, be doing too much to get attention or to feel like you got to do certain stuff to get put on, like, you know what I'm saying? Aside from that, uh, what you started off by saying in your answer here, uh, have you made the same mistake yourself or is it just observation? Um, I want to say the only mistake, well, one of the mistakes that I have made out of what I just said was uh, letting people play on my top, like make trying to make me feel less of myself because I had let them at a point of time uh, you know, I felt like, oh, I wasn't the hard, I'm not the hardest, she's better than me, or this and that, you know, but then I had to get out of that, like, nah, they got me messed up, like, you know, especially when it's, the situations be different, they trying to compare me to somebody that, you know, I don't know, I don't know how to explain it, but yeah, don't let nobody play on your top. But, yeah. This mistake, was it something you noticed yourself or others around you did and inform you of it? Uh, I noticed myself, uh, my, I, my mama, of course, my mother always knows, so of course she noticed it too. But I had noticed it myself for me to change my attitude, for me to change myself, so. Yeah. And was that easy or hard for you to snap out of, so to speak? Um, I want to say it was hard because I feel like it took too long. I felt like if I had been, felt the way I do now, I probably could have been, uh, I could have been in a, a different situation, like a better situation. But um, I feel like everything for a reason, like it's God timing, so I feel like it's whatever. When you mention God here, do you follow a religion? Yeah, I'm a Christian. And when it comes to Christianity, is it a certain denomination under it? Can you explain that? Okay, so according to Wikipedia, a denomination is a subgroup within a religion that operates under a common name, tradition, or identity. So for like example... God. In the Christian umbrella, oh. there may be people that see themselves as Eastern Orthodox or Roman Catholic or many varieties of Protestant, 
Protestantism. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. I don't know nothing about all that. <laughs> I just know I'm a Christian. I believe in God. I believe in there's a God, there's a devil. I believe in heaven, hell. I believe. I don't, I, I don't know. I, I can't even sit here and just act like I just know exactly what you just said. <laughs> I just know the, the simple stuff. Do right by people, and that's all I say. No oh, problem. I, I ain't gonna get to all that, but yeah. Curious though, when it comes to Christianity, why Christianity for you? That's what I grew up as. Under your mother or father? Uh, both. Or both. Both. Okay. Now, when it comes to music, mm -hmm. and it comes to the rap game. What are your thoughts on it in 2021, I, generally speaking? I feel like it's so easy to come up. And because it's so easy to come up, I used to drive myself crazy. Like, oh, it's just, like, they make it look easy. Let me put it like that. Because now that I'm here, it's like, okay. Actually, I can say it is easy. You just kind of got to, you got to network. You know what I'm saying? That's how I feel. Uh, so I feel like how I used to be back in the day, it was hard to get put on, but we got social media now, so it's very easy to network, to get yourself out there. You know what I'm saying? You just got to put the work in, and you got to network and stuff like that. That's how I feel. When it comes to the music industry, almost done with my music industry questions, what annoys you the most with it at this point, if anything? Is there anything that gets under your skin? Yeah. Uh, Let's say... Um, I'm so big on saying playing on my top because I feel like I just play a big part in everything. <laughs> but it's like, don't play with me. Like, don't play with my time. Like, don't waste my time. You know what I'm saying? I feel like they play a big part in a lot of stuff. I don't like wasting my time. Like, in any type of way, it could be you being late on sending a video. You're not sending my songs. You're not. It, it's so much that come with that. Like, I just feel like, you know, just, um, you got to get stuff done. Like, just, I don't know. Just don't waste my time, basically. That's my biggest pet peeve. On the opposite end of the spectrum, best thing about the music industry at this point, if anything? The love and the support I get. I love it. Like, it just fills my heart. It just do something to me. Especially when I'm performing. Like, that's probably the best feeling ever. Like, the love I get while I'm performing, the reaction I get when I get off stage. Like, the love. Like, so, just the love, the, the, the positive feedback I get from it. I'm still thinking about the other question. <laughs> I really got a brain for it. <laughs> well, just in case, let's just restate it. What oh makes gosh. a great rapper? <laughs> uh, the presentation. Maybe. I don't know. Uh, DJ Small Eyes. <laughs> I have a brain for it. I cannot think of the word. I don't even know. I can't even. I don't know. I feel like... Um, what makes a great artist, you got to put the work in. So you got to be a hard worker. Like I said, you got to be a great entertainer. You got to learn what your fans like. You got to learn uh, what people like to see. Uh, just like stuff like that. So.